Hey, this is Clay with CPAP My Way and CPAPMyWay.com. Today we wanted to bring to you a little something different. We want to start a little bit of a series with um, interviews um, of current CPAP users, CPAP professionals, and anybody that might be able to give us insight into life as a CPAP user or what may have gotten them started. Just interesting topics. So um, today will be our first episode. Please enjoy it. Uh, if you like it, please hit the like button below. And if you have things you think we might should add, we'd love to hear back. Just throw it in the comment section. We'll also have links in the description to a lot of what we discuss in case you're interested in anything that we discuss. Thank you and enjoy. All right, so I'm here with Mr. Robert Gonzalez, better known as Bubba G. And uh, he's a current CPAP user here with us at CPAP My Way. And so we wanted to, uh, because of his beautiful personality, bring him to uh, to the audience here and ask him a few questions about CPAP therapy. Hopefully, uh, help some of the people out there that are on CPAP or are considering CPAP therapy make a couple of uh, good decisions. He's a wise man right here. So, uh, thanks, Bubba, for joining us. Absolutely. So, how how long have you been on CPAP? I've been on CPAP now for um, three years. Three years, all right. What got you started? Like, what, what made you think I should find out if I need a CPAP? Well, um, my wife uh, would consistently complain. Number one, I snored like, you know, like the biggest bear in the whole country and uh, kept my wife up quite a bit. Number two, she, um, she would say I've stopped breathing, you know, quite a few times and would gasp for air. At that point, um, I felt like it was necessary to do some testing and um, you know obviously the test results come back I was pretty severe and um, that's what got me doing CPAP you know just just the heavy snoring and the um, the uh, the uh, choking at night yeah. even though I wasn't aware of it you know I always thought I just I slept like you know a lumberjack she she always says otherwise and uh, sure she you know sure enough she was right okay so um what type of what type of test did you do so i did a, a at-home test because i don't i don't particularly enjoy going to hospitals or staying the night at a hospital uh, so i did an in-home sleep test that was quite easy to use um uh, yourself clay uh, you set me up on that that um that test i took it home uh, strapped it around my chest. Even uh, a gentleman and myself with a with a very large chest, it was comfortable. Uh, was able to sleep with it, and uh, the results were back. I think within 24 hours. Nice, cool. Appreciate the shout out. <laughs> so, when you got the results, was it something you believed? Did you expect it, or was it like a little bit of a surprise? Because you said it was severe, right? So, it, it was pretty severe, and it was a surprise because I always thought I slept just fine, you know. I, I, had, I have no problem falling asleep. I have no problem waking up. Uh, I did, you know, I did realize that uh, I was groggy in the morning. Uh, but like I said, I had no problem falling asleep and I thought I slept great all night long. Uh, but until until I actually put that mask on that I realized I wasn't. Right. So when you first started, everybody wants to know, were you able to like, go the whole night with it or did it take you some time what, what was like night one or week one like so for me uh for me i actually started with the nose piece only um and i did not like that i typically i typically want to breathe more out of my nose and uh, it did not work for me so then I went to the full face mask, um, and at that, with the full face mask, I had no problem with keeping it on all night. With the with the nose only, I had an issue with keeping it on all night, but that's just my preference. The full face mask, uh, it, you know, because it covers, it comes around the back of the head, enables to, to enables enables it to secure to my head, and uh, I'm able to sleep with it all night. Okay, so. Um... You know, once you got the right mask, you kind of made it through a night, no issue at all, you feel like, or did it still take a little time? Can you still I mean, if you, once I got, yeah, once I got, I can say, yeah, once I got adjusted to it, it was fine. Okay. 
what did you feel it was like a week or two weeks or what did what would you say I, I, I'd, I'd say three days at the max three days okay i need that so uh you talked about your wife a little bit what, what does she think now i mean like with a cpap oh man she she uh she loves it you know number one she sleeps better you know number two i'm less agitated during the day so when i come home i'm not i'm not you know my sex life sex life is, is fantastic you know, now i'm sleeping better i got more energy to do all kinds of things go to the gym work all day um I, i'm not i'm not, I'm not drowsy during the middle of the day um the the, the dark machine is it had plenty of energy but i didn't and then once i started Wearing that machine, it was a it, it, it was a wake up call that I wasn't getting the sleep that I needed. Okay. So, what's the before and after look like? You know, like as far as I know, you had said it gave you a lot of energy and stuff, but you know, just give us the before and after. Like you started CPAP therapy, you really didn't even know you had sleep apnea, you didn't even think you did, and life after CPAP therapy. So start what you just said again. Before C so before CPAP, I thought that for sure um, I didn't have any problems with energy. Um, I do work outside every day, um, but I was getting groggy, you know, towards the afternoon. Uh, at 2 o'clock, I would get groggy. Um, after the CPAP, no issues whatsoever. Um, I, can, I can wake up in the morning feeling very well rested. Um, I can go about the day uh, through the night and... Um, perform any task I need to, you know, I need to do. It, it, it's quite nice to have a lot more energy than what I did prior to um, the, the therapy. Um, it, it definitely is a, definitely is a, a wake up call that um, I need, needed, the, you know, I, I needed a machine, you know, I didn't realize I needed it until I actually started using it. And then I was like, okay, what a difference. Yeah. So, uh, you know what type of CPAP you use? Um, I believe I use the, um, I believe the dream, the dream station. Yeah. And you're on an auto, right? I'll say it again. You're on auto CPAP, right? I'm on an auto CPAP and I believe it's the dream station. Yes. I'm on an auto one. So it, it, it adjusts as, you know, as the night goes on. Okay, cool. And you said you use a full face mask. You're using the, um, the Viterra still, right? Fisher and Paykel Viterra? Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, the best mask I have. The, the, I've used a couple different ones, and this has been the best, you know, that that the Viterra has been uh, the best one. The straps, I like the straps are soft, you know, they're softer on your head. And um, having a big beard as myself, you know, the mask has to come right, right around here, and uh, that mask seems to fit the beard a little better. That way, it, you know, it doesn't, I don't leak, you know, I can pull the data out of my chip, and uh, even with the beard, the mask does not leak, so that's why I like it. Okay, cool. So here's where you got to be honest. you ever go without your CPAP? Uh, I do. Um, I, I do go without a few. Sometimes, I, I, you know, some, I, 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 I have made the mistake of going without it. Um, there's been a few times where I've gone a couple days and uh, I definitely start to feel the effects of the sleep apnea, especially when you when you use the machine and then you stop using it. I, I, uh, I just went on vacation for five days and, at, and left the cord. And I didn't have it for five days and I really felt the effects of it. And then once I got back on it, I could definitely tell a difference. You, you can tell a difference you can, it's a much noticeable difference when you've been on one and you get off of it than if you've never been on, been on it before. Yeah, we have a lot of people tell us, you know, I, I don't have any problems. You know, they'll come in with their sleep test or whatever and they'll say, I don't feel bad, especially uh, people that really didn't want to have to get started on a CPAP. But what you're saying is you really didn't see the problems until you started to resolve the problem with sleep apnea. You know, once you resolved it, there was no going back. You felt different going forward. Oh, absolutely. It's, it's night and day. When you don't, when I don't use my machine for three or four days, um, which, you know, I have done that, it, it's, uh, it, it's night and day, you know. It, you, don't, you don't realize you have an issue until you, you, until you use that machine, and then you realize how much better you feel when you're on it. Right. Cool. 
Well, uh, if you were to like give some advice to people either thinking about CPAP therapy or that are about to get started, what, what would you say? I would say number one, get tested because that, that's very important. You know, as you can tell with me, I have a really thick neck, have a beard, you know, have a real big beard. So I was kind of concerned that, you know, with the mask, you can sit on my face. Um, you know, would I be able to wear it? But it, it, it's worth, uh, it's worth wearing it. If you, if you feel like, um, you know, if you're snoring at night, any, you know, if you're any type of snoring, and I mean, when I tell you I, I was snoring, uh, you know, I, I, I'd wake a whole hotel room up. I mean, it, it was, if you, if you had two, if you, if you had a system in your car, that would be me in my bed driving by snoring. <laughs> and uh, my wife, my, you know, my, you know, my wife, she sleeps 10 times better now. But, you know, the mask helps me not snore. Right. All right, cool, man. Well, Bubba G, I appreciate your time, man, and um, sleep well. I do appreciate you, sir. I appreciate uh, I appreciate everything you've done for me, and uh, uh, I'm glad that we got to have this talk, and I got to uh, ex you know share my story and give my you know give my testimony because uh, the, the 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 CPAP uh, is a game changer, and that that is for sure. All right, man. Well, we appreciate you. Thank you, sir. All right, see ya. Oh, bye.